this clip, we're going to be doing the French press. A couple of nicknames has been given. One is called the Skull Crusher. Another one, you know, I don't know, various different ones, suicides, you've heard different ones, but it is a French press. It is for the tricep. You notice he's in a laying down position on a bench, okay? Select what we call an easy bar. It's a bent bar, okay? Again, moderate weight. Don't pick too much weight to, to the first time you try it. Make sure you understand the exercise first, okay? If you notice he's got a close grip on his hands, okay? Arms nice and locked, sitting vertically, all right? When you're ready to go, all you're gonna do is bend your elbows, bringing your hands towards your forehead. When you get them pretty close without hitting your forehead, of course, you're gonna extend the weight back up in the air. If you notice, he's keeping the upper arm nice and stationary. He's not moving it back and forth. He's bringing the weight just to his forehead and back up. You can see the back of the arm. You notice he's getting a really good um, pump in the back of his triceps. This exercise is real good for that. Um, it is difficult, so again, make sure you understand the exercise before you actually try it with a light weight. Give me three more. And again, keep in mind, the form is very strict. No movement in the upper arm, very little rotation of the shoulder. And when you come to the top, make sure that you uh, lock up the tricep nice and tight. When you're done, you just bring the bar right back down to your chest. You can do one of two things. Either you can set it behind your head, like he's going to do now. Rest the bar down, or you can sit up with the bar, whatever's easiest for you. Okay? And sit up. There you go. Rest the bar on your legs when you're finished. And that is the French press better known as uh, Skull Crushers. And if you'd like any more information on this exercise, you can go to tnttrainingonline.com.